I saw there was a question about drag and drop uh, activity and having immediate feedback, and this is something that I was interested in. So I threw together a scenario really quick in Articulate Storyline, and what I did was insert these small icons, and what I want to do is have one of these icons be a correct response to drag onto the Pac-Man looking shape down here, and the rest of them obviously to show an incorrect response. I inserted all the images, placed them randomly, and then the first uh, task that I did was hit this insert freeform. Uh, right now it says remove freeform because I have it inserted, but you would click that, select the drag, drag and drop activity, and then what shows up is this drag and drop question box. I'm not sure of the exact specifics of this, but what I did was I set my drag items to make them active drag items, uh, each one of these pictures, picture one, two, three, four, five, and six. And I didn't give them any drop targets at this point. I'm gonna set that up in triggers. Uh, obviously, I don't have anything correct or incorrect at this point as well, but that's what I did to make them active, draggable characters, so that way when the application is running, the module's running, they are drag and drop. And what I did for the correct and incorrect responses is I set up layers for correct and incorrect. When they get the right one correct and drag it on there, it's just going to show a star. Uh, incorrect will show the no-no symbol. But what I did is I did this through triggers. And each one of these triggers, uh, what I want is this engagement is going to be my correct one. So uh, I set a trigger for this that says show the layer, correct star, and the when an object is dropped on, and that's this object, picture one, which if we look at the selection here, uh, shows the red around that. So I want to make sure that when this item is dropped on our pie down here, you can see that it's selected, and you can also have multiple targets, so you can have more than one correct answer. But So when I have that engagement dropped on the Pac-Man, I want that to show the correct star layer. And then what I did was just copy that trigger and paste it to my other icons here, but I changed the response to incorrect when they are dropped on the Pac-Man uh, shape down here. So if we preview this, what this does is, again, we've set up each of these as a draggable item, but we didn't give it a target until we showed it as a trigger. So if I drag this here, the engagement is going to show me my blue star, and obviously you would want to dim the background, have a way that they could escape, go back out, reset the slide, but um, you can do that. But the drag and drop activity is there for giving immediate feedback. Again, if we grab one of these that has the incorrect, we get a no-no symbol. And again, you would have some type of trigger that says try again, you would click it and it would reset the slide. So I believe that addresses having the immediate feedback. I think I saw that once before in another screencast, but uh, I couldn't find it and I was trying to figure it out for myself. I have an interactive map that I'm doing myself. So I hope this helps. I'd look forward to any feedback if there's an easier way to do this or maybe something that I missed. So cheers.